big part of this film from design point was the locations. The safe thing to do is track a new course back up on land. The arc of glass through this really harsh winter landscape was pretty difficult for everyone to pull off. Not only the time period, but the weaponry of that time period. Survival techniques, what these fur trappers were like, the, the idea of the mountain man. Then what we gonna do? Sit out there like a bunch of goddamn ducks? I'm talking to you. We sort of developed the idea that this film was a journey, so we were looking for a progression of landscapes that would change so you knew they were moving around. I ain't afraid to die anymore. Every location, in a way, has to be pointing to the right sun direction to shoot with the right light at the, at the right hour. It's very difficult to shoot nature. And when you start going out there to, to see the distance between the locations one to another and the reality of getting them in the right time, uh, you don't rule in nature. You are part of the nature. This is the most difficult movie I've ever done. It was very challenging. You know, we're constantly battling the weather and nature. This church we ended up doing is using all the colors of the landscape. We built a 1820s boat that would have been built out of rough lumber. We put a cabin on it that they could store their possessions in there, which were furs, and it held about 20 men. I, lo I love building sets so that they're shootable from 360. We built a complete fort, and I think you can walk around anywhere in it and not see any sign of construction. He wanted the movie to feel very naturalistic. He knows how far I came to find him. It was incredible challenging, but I think worth it a lot. It's full of richness and knowledge. There's a humbleness in Jack that is just delicious presence to, to be with.